Hi, this is Kent Vaughn with Blaze Performance Solutions again. Today I'm here to talk about the second key of execution, visibility. Now, just a reminder, when we say visibility, we're talking about this idea that everyone can see all of the daily and weekly activities and behaviors being completed by everybody else. Not just a few, a select few. Not just the people that are in your direct span of control that you work with every day, but everyone can see what everyone else is doing. There's no hiding. The crazy thing is, in most organizations, we really have no idea what people are consistently doing. We see the results, but in the meantime, what are they doing day in and day out? It's pretty hard to see that. It's pretty hard to keep up with that, unless you all are working in the same office. As I think about that, I'm reminded of something my father used to always say to me. He, said, he would say, Kent, show me. Remember, I'm from the state of Missouri. I want you to show me what you're doing, not just what you know. I used to say this a lot to my youngest son. Son, it doesn't matter what you know. It matters what you do. Now, knowing's important, but the doing's really important, and being able to see that. What was the worst was when my dad would say, you know, son, based on past performances, you knew nothing good was going to be said then. That was never, you did such a great job, I'm going to let you go to that concert. It was never very good. Well, as I think about that, let me share with you a client example. My partner, David Williams, has had a client for a few years that has been wanting increased top line revenue. And I've had pretty good results of that, with that. But as they have been working on this last year about improving top line revenue, they realized that one of the issues they face is, is customers going in out the back door. They're pretty good at acquiring customers, but not necessarily so good at keeping customers. That story has been told by more than one organization in the past. And so the organization did what you would expect. They bought a book about customer loyalty that had everyone read it. They did training around customer loyalty and they were very excited that they were going to increase customer loyalty. And if they increased customer loyalty, less customers would be leaving and you know revenue would go up. And you know what? After doing that with hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of leaders around the country, you know what? They had a 9% increase in customer loyalty and an increase in revenue. Wow, that's what they wanted. In the second quarter, one of those regional vice presidents came to David and said, hey, haven't you guys been working on a tool that could help us with that? Help us get better at this? And David said, yes, as a matter of fact, we do. Now, this tool was a previous generation of what we now call execution in your pocket, a dynamic gamified platform that makes it really easy to see what people are doing. But even with this previous generation, we could load in what was the goal that people could see every day. And we listed what are the five levers of customer loyalty that they wanted every person to apply every day with some customer. And now they could also have people put in, hey, here's how I applied one of these levers of customer loyalty today with a very specific client or a prospective client to grow business. Now, here's what's interesting. After they did all that training, all those books, they had a 9% increase in customer loyalty. Great stuff. That's the kind of stuff you would want. In the second quarter, that region that used this tool, we now call execution in your pocket, had over a 60% increase in customer loyalty that quarter. Now, those are the kinds of numbers you can hang your hat on. Now, how did it happen? Visibility. Everyone could see what everyone else was doing. Everyone could see how people were applying those levers of customer loyalty in their jobs to be more successful. They were sharing best practices. They were giving high fives to each other. People were motivated and energized at a whole other level. In fact, one of the things people told us was they loved the social connectivity. They also loved the results. I mean, that's pretty cool stuff. Now, here's what's really interesting. Halfway through that quarter, that regional vice president was meeting with a prospective client of his in Dallas, Texas. Someone he's known for 10 years. Someone he's been trying to get to change and do business with him for 10 years with no success. And as he made his pitch to this prospective client, he said, hey, everyone's going to tell you about all the great things they do in their organizations. Let me show you how we're doing it. And he showed this leader what this tool was doing for them. He showed her the five levers of loyalty and what people are doing and how they were doing it and the high fives they were giving and the social connectivity. He said, that's how we're going to serve your organization better than you've ever been served before. Now what's fantastic is he walked out of the meeting with the contract. He walked out of the meeting with that new order, specifically from that client wanting to know or seeing how they were going to be different than everybody else, how they were doing it differently. Now what's cool for Blaze is they also ask to see the tool from us. They ask us to do a presentation to them about why we use this tool and how we use this tool and what it would do for them. So how did they get results? How did they get that new customer that they hadn't had for 10 years? It's the definition of visibility. Everyone 
could see what everyone else was doing day in and day out. Not only was there no hiding, but they were sharing the best practices and learning, and it was amazing. Now, to me, that's what we're all trying to do. We just all want to get better. But you know what? I'm not the only person with a great idea. There are lots of people out there with great ideas. In fact, Deming said something fascinating years ago that I think is very relevant in this space. He said, if you want to understand the cause and effect in any job, you need to talk to the person standing within 12 feet of the job. Visibility allows you to see what the people standing within the 12 feet of the job are doing day in and day out. And isn't that what you want? And even better, everyone else to see it as well. Well, I hope you have a fantastic day. Good luck with visibility in your organization. I know it can make a difference. This is Kent Vaughn with Blaze Performance Solutions. Have a great day.